I basically wanted to make a uh, short video showing you guys what I've done so far for this uh, project. Um, so first I'm going to show you a uh, bunch of uh, mini figures and uh, let you guys uh, see what you guys think. So if, if, if you read the script which is in the links below on the Kickstarter page, uh, you're seeing this on YouTube, uh, it'll be links below as well. Uh, it's pretty much on my Facebook, uh, Digger 318 Facebook page where you see the script. Uh, at the beginning, there's like a prologue where uh, Doom Guy is with a unit of people and then in the uh, forest. Um, and he's ordered to uh, kill this um, this family, this like mother and child who were with this so called like terrorist bad guy. And, and so I have the uh, mother, um, the uh, son, of course. And, and the uh, father, who's like some scientist that's supposed to hang out to the fest. He's actually uh, the uh, director Spielberg. Laying out the fest. So there, there's these guys. Um, that's pretty much the Gordon Freeman head right there. Uh, if, if you don't want to use decals and stuff for official Lego pieces. So, so that's them. Um, because the woman has the uh, sad face behind. So that, that will work really well. Um, so, so these aren't custom made figures, I mean the woman's pretty much like a tennis figure with the uh, different head. Um, but then you have the unit of people. Um, I'm pretty much using a combination of the uh, new alien uh, conquest minifigures with different faces and guns and units behind them. Because Doom Guy will be wearing one of these units as well, he's not in his green armor yet, that's like that's has a white head there, because uh, his head's in the green armor right now. Uh, and of course he's got the douchebag, which has a slightly different suit and sort of tra um, transparent. Um, shiny helmet, because he's cool and stuff, from Jason Seropian. Um, those of you who know first-person shooters will recognize that name as like a combination of two other people who made a different first-person shooter, but the one's like nudge nudge. So he's got the douchebag face, because he's pretty much the bad guy in this uh, movie. One of the bad guys. So there's, there's this is the unit of people who, um, who Doom Guy works with before he gets sent to Mars. So um, there's, there's Doom Guy. He's supporting the uh, classic face, and of course he's not like a unique marine. So you know he's not the only one gonna have armor like that. So, so there's some other guy. He's like a garden. Um, you're going to see these people on uh, on the Mars base, and this is one of the different helmets. I'm going to put them in the background because if I get fun, so I'll make more Doom guys with the same helmets. Um, so he's just like in the back, like oh, I hope you don't notice I have different helmets. <laughs> so there's these guys. Uh, so other characters um, like 
like Doom Guy's neighbor who look af looks after his bunny Daisy. Uh, those of you who don't know, uh, Daisy is a bunny that was referenced in Doom and Doom Two. When 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 Hell attacks Earth, um, Doom Guy gets back to Earth and he sees that his bunny is like dead, so he jumps down, literally jumps down into Hell because of the anger that his bunny was killed. So you know, don't kill Doom Guy's bunny; he will come after you. Um, here's here's my look for Commander Keen. Uh, because he's a lot older now. Um, Commander Keen is another id uh, franchise in the past to the side scrolling, and um, that was before they made Doom. And I thought it'd be cool to have him go up and be actually be Doom's commander. Um, he's actually a toy, Toy Story body with a uh, different head and hands. Uh, toy Story army men. Um, next you have Tom Hall and John Romo, which are a mixture of names of Tom Romo and John Hall. Uh, uh, John Romo and Tom Hall. Um, they're like, um, one of them's literally the archi uh, architect, designer, and scientist uh, of uh, the Mars base in the story. So, you know, that's, that's pretty much literally what they are. Got the main villain, which is Mad Scientist, because he looks like a Mad Scientist. Uh, this is uh, Doctor Hector, and you also have Scientist Connor. I think that's him. So you got these science people going on about uh, on the Mars place. Because that's all. Oh, you need you need like cannon fodder. Um, so I have all these uh, mega block scientists right here um, with the mad scientist in the front so I'm using Lego face because he's going to be appearing at the front. And all these guys because um, when you play Doom 3 there's all these guys who are just so just like mechanics working in the back of them. Um, so there's all of them. Um, because I ran out of orange legs again, something looks a bit different, and they're going to be in the background instead of the front. Again, funds will be used towards getting the correct colors for the rest of them. So, uh, so you know, they, they, they match. This one's like a scared face because he's the mad one. There. There's just two mad people before hell breaks loose. So that, that's them. Now, of course, Doom is uh, important. Uh, the most important characters in Doom are like the monsters. So here's the uh, zombie guy. As you can see, he's using the um, decals already and it looked to look like the actual zombie guys from the game. And he's got pissed though because that's what Doom goes. <laughs> painted his hands red, just like in the uh, video game, and also painted the uh, feet brown, just like in the game. I use red, but when you mix red with green, it becomes brownish. You got the uh, shotgun guy, He's, uh, his decal is a bit slipping off, so I'm gonna you know, make him again, like repair him and so on, and not um, So that's him, he's on like a shotgun. And then there's a bunch of monsters here, uh, on, on this tray here, which, uh, this isn't it, uh, this is on the tray, but he's like a System Shock guy for the uh, System Shock Review episode. Uh, let, let's see, um, this is my first version of Pinky. Um, I mean, it looks okay, but I don't, not particularly like it too much. Uh, I do want to get some, uh, Mully Put, which is the clay I use to make custom Lego figures. Uh, Use Molly put to make a new one, to make it actually look like Pinky with all the stuff on the back. You can see there's all the other heads, uh, the flying skulls, um, spider mastermind heads, uh, these smaller spider heads, pain element and a uh, red thing, which I haven't made yet. Um, I made the uh, and the cyber demon. Um, if I get the funds, I'll give him the big legs. Uh, I think the legs from uh, Woody from Toy Story because they're now longer. Uh, chain gun guy, missing hands still, and uh, the uh, arch file. Uh, next we have uh, an imp without hands. 
Uh, and we got the um, omnibus. I think it's going to go on. Like, whoa, 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 guy underneath there. Um, to um, damn, I forgot their names. Revenants. Uh, again, they're not complete. Um, and the uh, Hell Knights and uh, the red version of Hell Knights. Of course, uh, you can't be doomed without the Gatekeeper. <laughs> Which is uh, quite funny, actually. A funny looking Gatekeeper. That, that's these guys. Um, oh yes, the, uh, the skull has a different face on the back, so it's like... <laughs> sort of thing. <laughs> so so that's, that's for the, for the minifigures I've done so far. Um, yeah, not, not too much. But some of them. I um, expect all the minifigures to have the quality of this one. Um, if you're sort of the backers who, who wants the minifigure of the £50 option. Uh, that's the quality you can expect. So, uh, like I said, uh, all the scripts uh, have been done. Uh, this, is, this is episode one. Um, right here, which you can uh, read on uh, the Facebook page, which the link is below if you're on the Kickstarter. Um, it's in the Facebook page of Digger Filmate and under and, and notes. Uh, and then you have episode two. This one's episode five. This one's the cast list, uh, which I haven't filled in yet, but you know, it's all done. Uh, episode 3. Uh, uh, episode f Episode 4. Which is the shortest one. Um, but there's a lot of stuff going on. It's a short script, but there's just st more stuff going on because, you know, sometimes I just type, oh, they fight and stuff, and then, you know, I'll skip it. Um, you see, yeah, uh, there's a Doom Picks folder here, which um, I've got Aztecs, Earth, Hangar, Jungle, Mars, Metal, Sky, Space. This is where I get the photos from on, on the internet and then sort of edit them. Um, for example, the Aztec one, I've downloaded all the uh, Doom uh, logos and Hell logos. Um, because there's, there's, there's Doom guy right there. It's the logo. Uh, which is an actual thing, I didn't do that. Uh, of course, uh, I have to uh, download. Um, don't push because I'll use him in one of these special effects fish tanks in the background. So that kind of happened. Well, these games without dope fish and stuff. But uh, you know, it's pretty much all these uh, Doom pictures. So the, that edit and that print out I'll show you guys in a bit in this video. There's Earth pictures, Hangar pictures, Jungle pictures, Mars pictures, uh, Metal, because Metal, <laughs> Skies, and Space pictures. Because the second folder is voices, uh, which is uh, everything voice recorded. And there's not too many files here, that's because uh, I ask people to record um, every episode in one go. So, for example, there's episode one uh, broadcast at the top, um, and there's episode one Hector, and then it goes down to down, down somewhere on here, and it's like episode two Marine, episode one Marine, episode three Marine, episode four Hector, and so on and so forth. Um, I know Doom Guy doesn't really talk, but because this is like a mini series, it's a, it's, a, it's a like a movie, a visual medium. He has to talk. He doesn't say much, uh, and, and he's always referred to as the Marine, and uh, no one ever calls him by his name. Um, yeah, so, so these are all the uh, voices, and uh, I'll show you guys some of the backgrounds. So yeah, on the big table in the kitchen slash dining room. Um, I recently just got this uh, green ball, which is for the jungle scenes, and many future animations for the uh, animations in the forest. If you look at my YouTube channel, you see that I did some forest animation with the um, silly Marvel videos. They're literally called silly Marvel because I did them in a silly fashion. And, and there's a jungle scene there, but I didn't have all these green plates. What I did was I got all these smaller green pieces and put them together, and the brown pieces sort of, sort of mud. Um, so, so that worked okay, but you know, sometimes I need bigger scenes. For example, the Doom one, I'm going to need a bigger one. Uh, so here I have these you know, sort of big black cardboards, um, which will be good for um, mixing the colors of the light and put them in the back, so, you know, behind the sets and stuff. Um, 
green paper, blue paper for the uh, minimal chroma keying blue screen effects. I have other colored sheets as well, more than this. Um, here's one of the printed out borderless printing I uh, decided to do. Uh, one of the background scenes when when he this is pretty much for when he's in the spaceship being transported to Mars on the first episode right at the end. So this would just be outside the window of the spaceship. Um, you can see it from the interior. Um, background of a town from episode one. Um, this is like a actually no, these feel like bad printed. That's why I look a bit red and pink. I suppose, but this is meant to be the jungle one. Um, I think I'm. Yeah, I printed them again already. Um, but I kept them because I've already printed this, so I might be able to use these. But this is like the hut where um, they find the uh, guy that they killed, that uh, Jason Wolfie wants to kill in the first place. So that's another misprint. So uh, an actual. Uh, this is a Mars background. Um, so it'd be good if I can get another one of these plates. That's actually a Mars white plate. Okay, here's the uh, correct print of the town, correct print of the jungle. So if you can think about it, I'm going to fold the bottom of course so there's no white line, but then they'll be at the back here, and I'll put all the Lego foliage on the front and plants and stuff, so it mounts with the uh, background picture. There's a lot of Doom 3 stuff, oh that one's upside down, <laughs> oh these two upside down. So I'm going to cut this out, just like in Silent Hill, um, I'll edit in the pictures here, so you can see that I, I use these in the background, and I'm hoping to put them in the background, and then I'll build Lego on top, so these are like the colleague shots. Okay, more backgrounds here, um, that I can use. It's sort of like, in order to make it look like Doom, I'll use Doom 3. Um, it logo right now, like a uh, say um, the one and do one we made by some fan who did the mods and maps and the uh, Doom 3 engine. Uh, turkey puncher, because that's important. Pitch of hell, this would be like one of the final battle backgrounds. Um, picture of hangers. Another picture of hanging. Um, Mars, Mars, more Mars. Take these, yeah, misprints again. Mars. Uh, this is the sky when the ship is leaving, and you're probably only going to see this in like half a minute when the ship is like leaving atmosphere of Earth. So I printed all this just for like you, you got to when you do these things, you got to print those background, even though you, if you're going to use it for such a short time. In, in one scene, you, you just can't skip out on these things. Uh, sky, this is probably gonna mix with the jungle in the first one when the troops are coming down. And more sky again, but I'm gonna use one this way up. It looks really nice. Uh, I like blue, people like blue skies. Okay, pick up Mars, because that's important. And, um, just space in general, which is also important, just for the ship to fly past. Um, and, and the reason if you, you might be thinking why I don't use just green screen all of these backgrounds in, because Lego is shiny and you gotta have a really, really big area with the green screen right in the far back, like really far away for you to even have any chance of using green screen with Lego, because you know, Lego is shiny and shiny means reflective. And reflective means all the green is going to pop up and show up on the uh, bricks. So uh, using green screen is like a bad idea. So that's us the um, project progress pretty much. Um, once I have built the spaceship, um, which I'm not sure what design I'm going to look, so if you know any spaceship designs, then go ahead and design it in the uh, Lego designer, that'd be great. And I'll credit you, of course, but uh, once I've done that, I can start filming the first scene, and all the scenes without any monsters, and then go from there. So, yes, thank you very much for watching. Uh, even if I don't get the funding on uh, Mars, on the Kickstarter page, I'm going to... It's going to be a really slow process, because I'm going to have to save money for it, but... 
I'm gonna try and push it forward anyway because I'm making this video because I, I wanna make a video for people to see. Uh, but hopefully I can get the uh, funding on the Kickstarter then I can quickly get all the resources which will also boost my own some uh, morale about making this video and push it out really quickly. Because uh, at the same time I'm doing the, the web series Geeko which I haven't put an episode out for like over a month now. But I haven't putting out all these toy reviews and all these uh, let's play videos to something to go on the uh, second YouTube site. Uh, so the first one, I just put on a lot of like old animation um, to delete the scenes that I haven't put on there for. Because I just didn't. <laughs> I thought, oh crap, I still have this deleted scenes I haven't put up there. And also all the Tonga animations that I stuck up there, which took a short while to make. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching and uh, take care and have a nice day. Bye. Oh hey Doom Guy, I see you're shooting zombie soldiers again. Hmm, cool. Hey, uh, by the way, when's uh, Doom Mars and Bricks coming out?